Hi there and welcome. In this video I'll show you how I combine different procedural techniques in Odini to create this final image. The full project can be found on the link in the description. So as you can see the caramel on this cookie ice cream has some layers across the y-axis. Let's see how that can be achieved within a flip sim. So for that effect I'm creating a density attribute by dividing my flip source into sections using the bounds of the point cloud. Also adding some noise to give it some variation and lurping between the sections and another noise on the bottom. Finally remap the density values to fit the flip sim and make sure you enable density by attribute in your flip solver. Now let's see how to create these undulating effects on the cookie borders. Basically I'm using the scene function along the curve view, making sure it's absolute to get only positive values. To ensure we get consistent sizes along the curves I am also multiplying by the length of the curve. And finally displace the position along the normal with those values. To create the burn defect on the edges of the cookie, I am saving the unshared points before the boolean, then group again the unshared points and group combine them to separate the holes from the border. And in the end just create an attribute mask with the distance along geometry for both groups. The drops were created after the seam and for that I am manually selecting a few points and copying a curve to it with a random p scale. Then just sweeping it, playing with the scale along curve and setting the end caps to grid. Create a VDB for both meshes and combine them. And finally we can blur the transition using a smooth STF with a mask coming from the second input. So the materials on this scene are quite simple. For the cookie I am using the saved attributes to drive the colors. Using the Material X Mix node with the masks as a mix factor to blend different colors. Then just use a random noisy texture as bump map. So that's what I have for you today, I hope you got something out of this and make sure to check out my Patreon where you can download this full scene and many more. Thank you and see you next time.